Hey everybody, today we're going to check out The List. This is another Next Fest game, and uh, this one looks pretty interesting. It's uh, one of those FMV type of games where it uses live action uh, cinematics, I guess, or scenes. And it has the same vibe, like exact same vibe of a game called Her Story. I've never played it, but it's where you play as a, well, this game, you play as a detective and you have to search through a database full of videos trying to solve a crime. I thought it looked pretty cool. And yeah, we're gonna check it out. This one comes out in June June 30th, so in a few days. I'm just hoping the acting isn't cringy. <laughs> Actually, I hope it, it is cringy. That might be kind of funny. All right, so WCPD, email, case files, read me. All right, I'll click on the read me first. First task with us will be getting to know your workplace and the tools. Yeah. We're re reorganizing our database. You have been tasked with the case B4673, also known as the Grady case. We need you to go through the database to check for dis discrepancies. The footage contains clips of Jordan Grady, who is our main person of interest, hence the case name. Okay, so he, he was the killer? And myself, who interviewed him, simply search for words within the search bar and make sure the words type match the words said in the video clips for myself and Grady. Tonight you will be going over only day one of our interviews. Anyway, the database is a crock of shit, so I'm leaving the handbook on the desktop for you to read. Also, left my case summary in your case folder for you to go over. Good luck. Well, there's the, the handbook. Grady file one. Assault and homicide, 243 Avalon Saint or er, Street bus station parking lot, September 5th, 2017, approximately 9:30. Jo Jordan Grady was assaulted by an unknown assailant at a bus terminal that resulted in Grady killing John Doe in self-defense. Grady claims John or Joe. Grady claims. D Doe had been stalking him outside the terminal and approached him at gunpoint. Once the 930 bus arrived, Grady acted quickly, resulting into a scuffle, and in the exchange acquired Doe's firearm and quickly shot Doe three times in the chest, killing him. Multiple eyewitnesses report the firearms was indeed Doe's, and Doe approached Grady. Alright, so... John Jordan Grady was just defending himself from the, the John, or I'm just gonna call him Doe or Dev. Wait, so if he if he died, wait, he didn't have any like identification on him or anything, no wallet, no phone. This is 2017. Everybody has a phone. September 8th. Of this year, a man named Jordan Grady was shot and killed. He killed an unknown assailant in self-defense. All right, assailant. Wait, and gave him a short rundown of what happened. He stated he noticed a figure had been stalking him ever since he first entered the terminal. The assailant. Had no form of identification on his person, only a memento, an unregistered firearm, and a list of names. All right, well, what if we can put take notes? Your email password is that. I'll I'll just take a couple notes, just so I won't remember. I don't know how much we'll get to actually see. Alright. Uh, 
who believed the attack was premeditated from there we knew we had to bring Grady in for questioning. I began questioning Grady on September 12th and interviewed him five times as the week passed. Learned a fair amount of information about Grady those five days, however I can, can't say much of it was useful. None of, a, none of it gave us a solid idea on why someone wanted him dead. I had a few theories, but none of which had any ground without anything we could prove. We had to give him, give in and let him go. Early morning, three days later, September 20th, Jordan Grady was shot in the back of the head while leaving his home in Santa Fe. I was cont contacted by Santa Fe police for consulting, but we still could not form, form a complete picture of possible motivation. For now, this case is left open. Myself and the rest of the department are unsure where to go next. All right. So the guy that he shot and killed, wait, jo Jordan Grady killed an unknown assailant and then another unknown assailant killed him three days later. So there's two of them in total. Email. I'll check out his email. Inbox. First week with, with us, file organization. Police database. Alright, I guess we'll just start with Jordan Grady. Wait, no. I don't know what we should, what we should sh search. I kind of want to hear his story. Oops. I began to move faster. So did he. I guess we'll just start with this. Uh, my name is Jordan. Uh, Jordan Grady. I began to move faster. So did he. I got into the rain. I began splashing the puddles were right behind me. And then he called out. Jordan Grady. All right. I'll search up John Doe. That's why I saw John Doe. Yeah, uh, that's why I saw John Doe. A bus station. Right. M my car broke down a few hours before, so I had it towed. I didn't want to be late, so I got my stuff, called a taxi, rode over to the bus station. Called a taxi. No, I, I can't say I saw anything, no. Bullshit. As far as I could tell, everything at the bus station was normal. The taxi must have seen something. Email. You can't save him, you can't save him, you can't save him. Who the hell is this? You can't save him. Nothing. All right. Uh, uh, I didn't think that was going to turn up anything anyways. Taxi. Right. M my car broke down a few hours before, so I had a tow. All right, car. It's the same one. Right. M my car broke down a few hours before, so I had a tow. Uh, I didn't want to be late, so I got my stuff, called a taxi, rode over to the bus station. Late for what? Right. M Damn it! Wrong with the same thing over and over again. Yeah, what was he? What was he doing? 
Where was he going? Where? Where to begin? It was raining hard that night. I'll just listen to this. You could barely see a thing. I was supposed to be my friends up in San Jose for the weekend to see a concert. Oh, there we go. Concert. I used the bathroom, and when I was finished, I opened the door, and I saw him again. Now he was sitting across from where I was sitting. Whoa. That was weird. I, I knew it had to be the same person. The way he sat directly across from where I was. The fact that he didn't even have any luggage. <laughs> no suitcase, no bag. There's no way they were there for a long distance bus ride. All right. I think I already searched bus. No, I thought he just moved on and that I was being paranoid. So I kept waiting for the bus to arrive. I didn't think about it anymore. I was just all in my head. I was making something out of something. That wasn't really there. I guess the, the magnifying glass signifies that I haven't watched it yet. I uh, waited. Uh, bus wasn't due until 9.30, so I had about 15-ish minutes to spare. But uh, that's, that's when I first saw him. The overhead speaker came on saying the bus for San Jose was pulling up in about two minutes. So I decided to try to distance myself from him, which probably was a mistake. So I grabbed my bag and I headed towards the exit. And I noticed right away he got up as well and he was following me. Yeah, I want to see concert. Whoa. What the hell? Oh shit. Data breach. The murder of Jordan Grady continues to go on unsolved. The truth can be found. Oh, that was the end. Did I like trigger the the end by searching concert or did I have like a certain amount of videos that I could watch before the the demo ended? We can do that again. Just keep playing. It doesn't want me to play anymore. I think I have to quit and then come back to play more. Cause I hit play and then it just showed me the credits again. Yeah, look, you can't play anymore. It doesn't let you. This must be like the full game then. Cause it was a pretty big uh, download. Damn. Maybe we'll have to check this one out. This would probably be a good streaming game. And we should check out her story also. This is a short demo though. <laughs> sucks that you can't play it over and over again. That sucks that we can't play anymore. But I was getting into it. I think there's like a process of investigating that I just haven't, I couldn't grasp within that like 15 minutes that we were playing. I was just looking for keywords to search. I wanted to like kind of watch it him explain what happened from the beginning and then just take words from what he was talking about just trying to piece it together see if there's any discrepancies i didn't even get to choose or search the the stuff that i put in the notes like the list and unlicensed firearm forget the, the last one pretty cool game though Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Maybe we'll check this game out when it comes out on the 30th. 
We'll see. Goodbye.